What's down, my people? You're not tuned in to me TV. Now, we're going to bring you all the stories about the stories that we need to bring you stories about. You feel me? So, that's what we're going to do. Some stories might be good. Some story might be tragic. But, hey, man, that's how these stories go. I don't make it up. Now we getting into it. You feel me? So before, look, man, bang the like button. Bang that subscribe button. You see them on the screen. Yeah, them right there. Hit the like and subscribe, man. Hit that right there. Now we about to get started with our story. Yo, 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 what's up, my people? As you see the title, you see the thumbnail. We got your boy, Jama Rent. In a building. Before we go any further, man, I need you to hit that like, hit that subscribe, man, and hit the notification bell so you can get all my posts when I post them. You feel me? I need y'all love, man. Hit that subscribe button. You feel me? Now, as we know, John Morant has been getting into a lot of trouble lately. And here's a picture here where he's got a gun. He showed with a gun for the second time. In in a le- in two months, right? And why is this a problem? No, it's not illegal for him to have a gun, but this guy is worth over two hundred million dollars and probably more. I'm, that's just an understatement of what I'm saying. He has a a, a big d- Nike contract, Powerade contract, and many more endorsements on top of the money he's already making in the NBA. Due to his antics earlier in the year, where he had a gun, he's lost out on $39 million because he didn't make the All-NBA team, right? And as you see here on the screen, you see this is the first incident. And you got to understand, these are self-inflicted. These are not anyone doing this to him. This is who he is, right? Because... Even when he stopped posting it and even when he don't post it, right? He will still be carrying these guns on him because, like I said before, it's not illegal. He still will have these guns and he still will be hanging with these types of people. Now, I'm not just totally blaming his friends for this. He's 23 years old. He's not a little kid. He has a kid. He has a woman. He has a family around him. So these are things he should be more aware of. Like, yes, if you're going to carry a gun, it's cool. It's not illegal. But why are you flashing it on Instagram? And understand, yes, he's 23 years old. So they came up in a culture where it's Instagram their whole life, Facebook their whole life. They they never lived a life of no of a world without social media. So they're more prone to to catch some of their most embarrassing or just normal times on camera. You feel me? But this is crazy that he went right back to the situation that just got him in trouble. Now, mind you, I don't think the first situation was severe enough. I don't think he actually really learned his lesson from the first time. And mind you, he's the breadwinner of the family, so a lot of people is depending on this guy. Like, if he falls, the whole Morant family falls. So, it's not just backlash towards John Morant. It's his whole family that has to endure and go through these things as well. And don't get me wrong. This guy is must-see TV. This guy is blockbuster. This guy is, I wish the New Orleans Pelicans would have drafted him and didn't draft Zion Williamson. That's just a disclaimer for the video. So y'all can understand how much I like this guy as an athlete, as a player. And I don't think he's a bad person. I think he's making poor decisions due to the environment that he grew up in. You got to understand, this guy's from South Carolina. This is a very, very small town. So now that this guy has this money he just acting out either the things that he was around or the things he have seen within his lifetime 
and let's just be clear. We know John Morant as a basketball player. We don't know John Morant as nothing else but that. So that doesn't mean this stuff is not in him. The only thing I see wrong in this situation is that he's recording his uh, pitfalls, his embarrassments, his downfalls. Like, don't record that type of stuff. You feel what I'm saying? But this is a sad case. I think the NBA is going to come down on him real, real hard. If y'all can remember, Gilbert Arenas went through a similar situation, but he actually brought the guns into the facility. And he got he got 50 game suspension. But not did he just get that. It tarnished who he was, his name, and people didn't want to deal with him. He had endorsements. He had this and he had that. But all of that was taken away. But, man, let me know what you think about Ja Morant, him doing this for a second time. Just leave it in the comments, man. And let me know what you think, man. Like, comment, and subscribe. And you already know I'm going to be back with another one. You heard me? It's me, TV, you dig?